we're exploring today in San Francisco. We're going to go to the zoo. We've got a whole bunch of new videos mapped out for the YouTube channel, DIYs and exploring with the Blaco family. Also, check out our page on Facebook, Paranormal and Abandoned Travel with the Blinkfields. I just uploaded a live video on there of the Crookedest Road in San Francisco, and there's going to be lots more live videos and behind the scenes stuff, so be checking our channel and follow our Facebook page. I hope everyone's having a blessed day, and we will see you in a little bit when we do our check-in. If you're a stripper, you make really good money in San Francisco. They have a lot of uh, like gay bars and like strip clubs. And if you work down here, you make good money because you know people want you to shake that money maker. Will you shake that money maker? <laughs> you know, you could probably make really good money. What do, you, what do you think about working at a gay bar? I'd come, I'll throw dollar bills at you. You would, I would throw dollar bills at you. <laughs> you're not playing Pokemon Go while we're driving, are you? Or the light. Like, you're really... I'm waiting for the traffic. Oh, no, your, your maps are open to where we're going. <laughs> yeah, we're going to the zoo. You belong in the zoo. You look like zoo! an animal. Zoo! Mommy, zoo! Zoo. That's right. We're going to go see the animals. So, yeah, yeah. Your dad talked to them, and we're going to drop you off at the zoo, Okay. I was like trying to figure out where the stoplight was. <laughs> no, we're just waiting on them. Well, it is San Francisco and things get kind of crazy down here. I think I just mural on the wall. Food might be cold. 
<laughs> by the time he gets to you. Fun. That's a good thing now. Apparently, you cannot have a car, but as long as you have a bicycle, you can still deliver someone their food. I, I would rather have someone deliver me my food in a car if I was going to do that. But I'm not. I'm not lazy, and I actually go pick up my food. <laughs> downtown uh, Chinatown part of San Francisco if anyone's wondering I don't think I said that um, and that is why you're seeing a lot of the uh, signs in Chinese we are uh, vacationing we do not live in San Francisco we are just visiting the area and this is a beautiful area It would be better if I had a GoPro that I could stick on the car. I'm just, just saying. <laughs> no shit. Right? Hey, there are viewers that are children. You cannot swear in the video. Oh, poop. Oh, that just sounds ridiculous. You just can't swear in the video. Oh, shit. They will, they will flag the video oh, shit. if you do that. Stop. because there are people that really don't uh, care and that they do drive uh, mindlessly in San Francisco. Not everybody, but there are people that uh, drive with no care in the world. And um, there's a lot of accidents down here. Um, and there's a lot of like car theft or break-ins depending on what part of San Francisco you are in. Um, they do have signs posted. We have not uh, been one of those people that's... Uh, had that happen to us but we're also really careful we don't you know always put your stuff in your trunk don't leave any valuables um lock your car put up your sunscreens in your windows uh to keep your car cool because it does get um hot not super hot like if you were living in Reading, where it's like 115 right now um but they do they do have hot semi-hot weather here and they do have a lot of like theft and break-ins so uh just keep that in mind if you do visit san francisco but that is the case Oh, that's not just in San Francisco. San Francisco is one of the most expensive places to live in California, but it is also a beautiful area. Continue on to Fourth Street. Um, they do have the highest number population of um, homeless in, in the area. Um, they have done a lot to clean that up over the years, so you do not nearly uh, see that as much as they do compared to 2009. <laughs> they do have a lot of street vendors down here and a lot of interesting things to, uh, to look at. And they do have a lot of street art. That is like one of the things that San Francisco is known for is their street art and their art programs that they offer. There are an extremely high number of artistic individuals uh, in San Francisco, ranging from sing singers, dancers, people who paint poetry, write books, and more. Can you look at the county agents? Oh, well, it's huge. If you're a stripper, you make really good money in San Francisco. They have a lot of uh, like gay bars and like strip clubs. And if you work down here, you make good money because you know people want you to shake that money maker. Will you shake that money maker? <laughs> you know, you could probably make really good money. What do, you, what do you think about working at a gay bar? I'd come, I'll throw dollar bills at you. You would, I would throw dollar bills at you. <laughs> you 
You're not playing Pokemon Go while we're driving, are you? Or the light. Like, you're really... I'm waiting for the traffic. I know, your, your maps are open. Where are we going? <laughs> yeah, we're going to the zoo. You belong in the zoo. You look like zoo! an animal. Zoo! Mommy, zoo! Zoo. That's right. We're going to go see the animals. So, yeah, yeah. Your dad talked to them, and we're going to drop you off at the zoo, okay? put the video out there. What the heck? Talk about ridiculous glitches. Look at Mama. Hey. Mama. Okay, I'm gonna take the drink away. Hey, don't make a mess with the frappe, please. The straw's getting pulled out too many times. That's what he said. Ha 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 ha. 